World Health Organization says a mysterious new virus detected in the Chinese city of Wuhan is likely to be from the same family that produced the deadly SARS and news outbreaks. The growing concern across Asia as the Wuhan pneumonia outbreak continues to spread. With the alarming news tonight about the coronavirus, devastating at every level. It may be up to 70% transmissible, out of control and spreading fast. Tens of millions of migrant workers suddenly found suddenly themselves, found themselves without, jobs. without jobs. Migrant workers across the Middle East have been at the front lines of the pandemic, carrying out essential jobs in healthcare, agriculture and food production, transport and services. Yet many of these jobs are characterized by low wages, precarious working conditions and limited social protection. Achieving decent work for migrant workers, therefore, has to be a central objective of future labour migration policies in line with the 2030 development agenda. Poor working and living conditions provide an environment where the virus can spread rapidly. Migrant workers have limited or without access to healthcare. Also, they are not part of the social infrastructure where they work. Locked out because the pandemic has interrupted the regular pattern of migration on which many depend. Migrant domestic workers under the pandemic, those who work as freelancers, have less jobs because employers no longer call them in for work, fearing that they may bring virus. So without job, without income, they don't have anything to rely on their situation becomes extremely vulnerable. The purpose of this event is to reflect on lessons learned while bringing together the different perspectives of state actors and international organizations representing both employers and migrant workers. The objective is to facilitate a constructive and inclusive dialogue that develops best practices and recommendations for future crisis response that support migrant workers. We see this event as a chance to consolidate the experiences gained by states, employers and employees during the pandemic while looking forward towards the future.